Hey everyone, this is Judy with JLB Crafts. Welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, thank you so much for giving me a try. In this video, I'm going to be setting up the monthly view in my social media and the monthly view in my wellness and fitness planner in the same video because they go relatively quickly. Um, but I'm gonna go, I'm going black out in my social media. I'm just gonna use the pages as is in my wellness and fitness, but I'm, I don't know how long this is gonna take. I might run out of time, so I like to turn in my my social media planner I list all of my videos as well as um, my my uh, end of the month income from Amazon and YouTube and my monthly uh, change in subscribers on this page so um, and then I, I flip and I have my challenge tracker pages which I already posted the video for this I'll link it in the cards up above just in case you missed it um, and then I get to my dashboard spreads so the first thing I'm gonna do I have those of you that have watched my unboxings that I put on my channel here recently know that I have been totally addicted to Sticker Guru. And their $2 Tuesday stickers, I got a bunch of them. So I have um, bunches of purple and orange and this holographic silver. I need to decide if I want to go with spider webs for my date stickers or ghosties. Right now I'm leaning toward ghosties because I have uh, more spiderweb stickers but I don't have a ton of other ghosty stickers so um, and then I have the only color you didn't see here that's kind of witchy is green so I'm gonna start I'm gonna speed this up I'm, I have a uh, metallic marker in like a lime green um, it's a bullet point so I'm gonna draw in my grid uh, on these pages. I'm going to skip these empty boxes um, and just leave myself some blank space. So I'm going to, I've already speeded it up um, and I'm going to go ahead and do that really quick. And I'm just going to, I'm going to, I'm doing it freehand. Um, since it's a dot grid, I feel like I can, I can go ahead and get away with just freehanding this. I, it's Halloween, right? So if the lines aren't perfectly straight, I don't mind so much. Um, it, it's okay for me. I mean, the whole point of like a haunted house and stuff is that everything's not perfect. It's a little creaky and off kilter. So I'm totally fine with that. Okay, so this is what I have so far. It's a little weird without those filled in, isn't it? I'm not too sure what I think about that. I might have to uh, think on that a little bit because here's, here's where my brain is um, I still got to put my days of the week up there so maybe I'll just I think I'll go ahead and draw the rest of this in but not divide it up so it's just a couple of big 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 boxes let's do that yeah that way I can put my days of the week on there next thing I want to do is go ahead and put uh, grab my tweezers and go ahead and put my date my numbers on there and I think I am going to go ahead and use the ghosties because like I said I have uh, spider webs in uh, other forms so but I don't have a lot of ghosties so I'm just gonna speed this up while I go ahead and put my my numbers on here next thing I need to decide is how I'm gonna do my um, Sunday through Saturday so one option I have is these are the blackout overlay tapes from girl boss Anna um, I do if you use the coupon code JUDI10 Judy 10 you will get 10% uh, off and if you put Judy in the comments you will get uh, my free sampler of all of the green overlay tapes for the sea glass collection so and these are from Girl by Santa too these are uh, days of the week these are the ones I'm going to use they're the right width I can I can make them they're small enough to work in here so all I need to decide is do I want to go white right on the black or do I want to use, I'm thinking these overlay tapes and put the words on in black over top of them. Maybe I'll go ahead and do that. And so I'm going to, I'm going to speed it up again. There'll be a lot of speeding up on this because I need to add so many things to, to create this layout. Um, and I'm going to start over here. Um, since that's the old, that one's closest to the edge of the page to make sure I have enough room for it. So I'm going to put these on and then I'm going to put my days of the week over top and I'm, it's okay if these come down onto that top line I don't I don't mind that at all 
I think I want to grab a really fat brush pen and write October over here on the side. I'm going to go with green because I've got lots of green already and I've got, I'll stick to more orange and purple on my deco. So let's go ahead and do that next. So I have a, this is a Zig Fudebiori metallic uh, Kuratake. You can get some of these off of Amazon. I couldn't find every single color, so I ordered a lot of them. You can order individual pens from several retailers on AliExpress. Um, and I have the full set of these, both metallic and non-metallic. So, But I need the metallic because I'm writing on black. So let's go ahead and do this. Drum roll, please. I'm just going to write it real big. I'm going to take this whole space and write it in on the side here. I love how well that matches. Oh my gosh. It's going to lighten up a little bit as it dries. It's really, really wet. That's the nice thing about these pens is they're very, very juicy. But, oh my goodness, I love it so far. All right, so being careful not to smear that, let's look at my sticker guru stuff. So I have two different $2 Tuesdays here. I've got the Harry Potter ones, um, which also they had some tarot card-like stickers. These are full box stickers. Um, well, these are. So let's see, spooky, 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 happy Halloween. I think I want to put Happy Halloween down here. Um, I think the purple one. And then there are a bunch of these other stickers that I thought I could kind of put along here maybe. So, and then normally, let me grab September so you can see. Normally, don't want to smear my October. Normally I color code with overlay tapes, but I don't have black blackout overlay tapes in all the colors I need for my color coding. So what I'm going to do instead is color code by using the pens that I need. Um, so I'll write, instead of writing dashboard in black and covering it with a purple overlay tape, I will just write it in purple and so on to get my color coding accomplished that way. And then the note about the video, I can just write all of that in, in white on here. So, so that'll be my boxes. Um, so I, and then I can put my, I track start and end on a couple different statistics. Um, and like I said, my um, little bit of income from my channel. So let's go ahead and go, what did I say? I was going to go with happy, happy Halloween, and I think I want that down here. Now since this is a full box sticker, but I'm not putting it over anything, I think I'm going to trim it because it'll be just a tiny bit fuzzy, and I don't need it. I don't uh, need it to have all of that clear. It's a full box sticker so that you can overlay it over top of a deco full box sticker, but I'm not going to do that. So we're just going to trim it. See, so let's, but let's go ahead and put something underneath it. Um, I have those kitty cat stickers, but I think I'm, I'm going to go blackout I'm going to spill the beans. I am going blackout as well on my um, catch-all monthly view. So we'll save the kitties for that view. So let's put, do I want, I don't, yeah. I'm going to go ahead and put this in silver hollow just right here at the bottom. And then we'll put, since Halloween is right there the 31st, um, I think it works to put this down here. I don't know how well that's going to, how well does that show up over black? I mean, I can see it because it's foil. Can you all see it? Yeah. When the light hits it just right. Okay. And then I want something over top of it. Um, maybe the garland. Let's put the garland over top of it. That stuff needs to hang straight down pretty much. So if you rub this down, less of the clear starts to show. So I kind of want more spider web there, I think. Let's put more spider web there too. Oh, and we can have the witch flying overhead. That garland can be attached to the spider web. Since I've got all these empty boxes up here, I can absolutely put all my stats up there. So 
that means I've got plenty of space for all, all deco down here. Let's put the full moon, the um, which down here? Do I have, oh, I've got bats too. The bats are purple, that's okay. Wait, do I have non-purple bats? Oh, I have orange bats. Ooh, ooh, wait, except that that's again, another full box sticker so I can chop it. Yeah, let's chop it and put the orange bats in there. Except I want, I want my witch over top of the bats. Because I don't want her hollow to be dulled by the matte sticker over top of her. And if, like I said, if you rub this down, it makes it pop a lot more. Cool. Love it so far. Okay. So then up here, let's see. Let's think about how I want to do this. The next thing I want to do is go ahead and fill in the um, little bit of uh, functional stuff that I want to put on here. So I do a start, end, and change over the month of, of Instagram followers and YouTube followers. So I could put like one here and one here and then some deco in the middle. So I thought these guys are supposed to be cats, but they look more like mice to me. So I think that they are kind of appropriate for um, the monthly view here since we're kind of spooky Halloween and a lot of people are freaked out by a lot of people are kind of freaked out by mice <laughs> so we'll do there's YouTube let's do Instagram up here okay and then over here I get um, my Amazon affiliate links generate a little bit of income and my YouTube generates a little bit of income. These are the only like foil dollar signs I could find. It's really, really big, but that's okay. These are from Simply Gilded, which I have, by the way, I have links in the description box for anything I could link to. So I have a link for Simply Gilded, for um, if you sign up for her No Span newsletter, you get a coupon code for $5 off a purchase of $15 or more. And I also have a link for Sticker Guru um, for, uh, if you use that link, it'll get you a 15% discount. So these say payday. I actually got these in a grab bag uh, from Sticker Guru. I've never used them, I just got them. So we'll go ahead and use I've got all the foils mixed on this spread, so. <laughs> okay, so that says payday. And then we just, I did grab an orange jelly roll so I could write in the stuff that I don't have stickers for. So we'll put, we'll put um, Amazon affiliate, YouTube, um, and then the dollar sign and the, I put on for the date because sometimes if it, if a day falls on a Sunday, it changes a little bit. So, and then over here we'll do Instagram S for start E for end, and then a triangle, which is a chemical engineering symbol for change. Okay. So now we can fill in some deco. I want, I want a spider web or something up there. So I was just looking, let's look through all of my sheets here to see. Um, I have this sheet, there's a purple, two purples and an orange. Since I've got two purples, let's put this one up there, that creepy looking spider web. I'm just gonna decorate the rest of the stuff here. So we'll put our creepy spider web up there that I can put in these two center. Well, I didn't really leave myself much center space there, but I do have a little bit of space there and there. So and these are considered dividers. Ooh, there's some creepy houses. Since I've got lots of orange and green all around that one, I think I want either purple or silver. So I could put the purple houses there. And then Ooh, there's that too. I, I should have put, I should put the taller one. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take the houses, if I can, carefully. Since I just took them down, I might get lucky. Yep, all right. Since the houses are shorter, I'm gonna put them over here because they'll fit underneath. And I'm gonna put this taller one with the tree and the grave. Can you see that? The tree and the gravestones and the bats. We're gonna put that over here because that's taller. I need something for there and a little more for there, I think. 
Oh, there's some more spidery garland. I don't have any silver right there. Let's do that. I, I bought so many stickers, you guys. I can't even remember what all I have. <laughs> Let's put silver. Can you see it? Spider. Spider's hanging down. That's perfect for right there. I just think I want a little bit of something right in here. Um, I could just do something like, ooh, there, how about that RIP? I like that. Can you see that? Or I could put one kitty cat on there. I don't have any kitty cats on here. Let's put one kitty cat on there. I know I said the kitty cats were going to be for my catch-all. And they still will be, but why not? All right. I mean, I could keep going, but I, I think... I, I don't really need to because I, I still have all the writing I got to put on here. So let me show you what we're going to do. This side, I don't need to do anything. Um, this just is going to be an extra page now. This side, however, I do want to be my divider. So what I'm going to do, just like any normal, oh, I got to move on my post-it notes. Just like any normal Franken planning, um, I'm going to go all the way around this page. Even though it's the monthly divider and it's extra thick, it doesn't matter. I'm still going to go all the way around it with some tape runner even in between the punches and then stick the two pages together and that way when I f it's it gonna run right next to the October the October will still show it'll still stick out and show and um, it's I mean you just you can Franken plan it even though it's got a tab and it's a little bit extra thick so there we go all right so stay tuned and we'll go ahead and do my um, wellness and fitness planner real quick so the only thing I write in here is symptoms. Um, so, you know, what, what days you had headaches, what day your period started, ladies, um, what day, you know, my knee started hurting or acid reflux or whatever. So that's what I put here. You put there whatever makes sense for you. So if you're much more fitness oriented, maybe you want to put your step counts or your calories or I don't know, calories in and out, whatever, whatever will work for you. It doesn't have to be a ton of information, but it's, oh my gosh, it's a space that you don't want to let go to waste. So I am using the seasonal, um, the vertical planner for my wellness planner this year and I do have the sticker books that go with it but most of those stickers are gigantic and they're also always the first stickers I go to for this monthly view so I wanted to change it up this month I have oops I have the the happy planner wellness planning sticker book with the yellow orange cover because I feel like that says fall and will go with the colors that are already on the page so we might get some stuff out of here um, but I like I said I have three different small shop sticker books so I have fall memories from Amber plans her day um, because it's got some really really great fall quotes in it um, I love make an make it an October to remember I like that one um, and since we have a whole big bunch of empty days across the top here. Um, I thought it would be good to grab that one because it's long and thin. We can put it on either side. Uh, secondly, I have grabbed the Posh Fall sticker book. I can't remember. I know she reprinted one. I can't remember if it was this one or a different one. And this is the Fall 2022 book. But I put 2022 on here because that's when I got it so years from now if she's got other posh fall books i'll be able to remember which year i got this one from so and i went through here just looking for stickers that had kind of some orange maybe a little bit of a uh, kind of burgundy kind of purple feel to it but i also kind of want even though um this one isn't really super halloween to me um i saw these stickers and um, uh, there's a set of books uh, I have been reading by Laurel K. Hamilton. I actually haven't read any recently, but um, I was caught up on those. And there's a room they go through with these giant roses with thorns all across the ceiling. And since it's fairy, they move. And if you're an interloper or a bad person, 
um, they would, can come down and grab you. These giant thorns, like foot long thorns. And so I just thought, I saw this sticker and I was like, I want to put that across the top of these empty boxes. Plus the colors kind of match. So I'm thinking I want to use that one. That was a long explanation for that. And then lastly, I pulled the Fall Icons by Kelva Plan, which is also 2022. Um, because these stickers I feel like are the right colors. But they're also very, very like self-care kind of. There's a lot of, of self-care, which is what, what my wellness and fitness planner is kind of is about. Like the sweaters and the long sweater sleeves and just the the teapot and the cozy snuggly feels. So I thought I might use some of those as well. There's another set here as well. Maybe I'll save these for November. Um, they, they go as well. So either one of those. I don't know how much of these I'm going to use, but I absolutely know I want to start by cutting this sticker in half and putting it across these six boxes. So let's start with that. Um, actually, before I even do that, I do want to white out notes here real quick. Don't need that. There we go. All right. So let's take this sticker and I think what I'll do is put the edge of it right here at the edge of there, trim it right there, and then we'll just see how much further out I can go with it. So I want to start it at this edge. Let's grab my super pointy tweezers. Find the edge of it. There we go. So I'm going to grab my wax paper and do it that way. I just need my wax paper under there somewhere. Don't pull this super tight. Just like a run, a long run of washi tape. A sticker like this will stretch and then it will cause your page to curl so all right I'm just gonna kiss cut it right on the line there and kiss cutting just means I'm gonna cut through the sticker but not the page underneath that it's stuck to now it's driving me nuts I can't think of I'm gonna have to pause it and look for the what that series of books She's the Queen of Fairy, though, and it's by the same author that writes the Anita Blake books. If you know, you know. Mary is her name? I don't remember. Anyway. And, of course, it wouldn't be one of my layouts without a big cat hair stuck in there somewhere. All right, so it did go over a little bit, but I think maybe I can take... I'm thinking maybe this corner sticker... And kind of mask that a little bit. I don't know. Let's see. No, let's see if there is a a box sticker that I can put with it. So switching back over to this book, there's a lot of blue in this in this one that's not over here. Uh, oh, there's a yellow one. That one could work. Just if I put something in the corner here, it'll to kill two birds with one stone. It'll cover up the whiteout and it'll cover up the cut end of this sticker. Although I could, you know what, before I get any further, before it welds itself down, I'm just going to trim this. Kiss cut again. Before I go through, jumping through a bunch of hoops to try to somehow meet up to that edge. If I just cut it right on the line at the edge of the box, It'll look like it's supposed to end there and it'll be just fine. So, and that tiny little bit of sticker, I'm not going to worry about wasting. Okay, so now though, but let's go back and see is there a box sticker I want to put there from either of these sets? Ooh, that's pretty. That matches too. Was that the other set? I think it was. Look at that. I like that. I want that one on there. So, this planner for me, wellness and fitness, is all about self care. I just love that. But I don't really have, since it would need to come out kind of this way, I mean, I, it definitely could. It could come out partially onto the day. Do I want to put that there? I kind of do, actually. Let's put one of those on there. Very self care, like I said. I'm not leaving myself any place for this quote, though. Where do I put this quote? Make it in October to remember. Will it fit up there, actually? So the problem is it's not super, super, super bold. Um, so I'm not sure where it's going to show up. Although, if it comes down a little bit, it's okay. So I could go right there with it. 
It almost fits there, but it looks a little crowded. So the problem I'm having is these two are pretty symmetrical. So I feel like if I put a quote here, I need to do something here as well. So, oh, I put a spell on you. That's a good one too. Homegrown harvest. Let's, I'm just looking for a something similar to put on the other side before I commit to this one and then don't have anything to balance it with. Fall bucket list, take a nature hike. I think I can find something. Hey there, pumpkin. That's a good one. Okay. All right. So since there's a pumpkin right there, let's put this one, make it an October to remember because the October, October, like I said, it's okay if it covers up a little bit of the, of the, of these days, because I just need to write a couple, a little room for symptoms there. And then let's put, Hey there, pumpkin on the other side. And that way they'll be kind of, they'll be balanced. That works. That feels balanced. It's a little matchy matchy, but there are going to be discs in there too. So that'll help. Um, the only other thing I could do is maybe uh, one more quote, maybe down here. Um, I was going to put this over there somewhere and just let the legs kind of stick out. I like that. I don't know why. I just really like that. Okay, let's look for some kind of quote for here. Boots, flannel, pumpkin spice, and everything nice. I'm a fall kind of girl. Oh, I love that. With the two girls, let's do that one. It's absolutely true. And I feel like it definitely fits with the two girls right there. Or parts of girls. <laughs> is that gross? Parts of girls. I guess it is October. Scary movie season. Okay, so I feel like that's enough of all of that. I, I actually did end up using, I think, at least a sticker from each of my small shops. Um, I, I've got all the deco up here. I feel like I want a little bit of something down here if I can find it. So I could do a small something there. Or maybe is there a corner sticker from this set that could work down there? Here we go. Let's see. This corner sticker, I mean, it would really fill in the 29th, but if something, if I needed to write something there, I could put this one down there too with the spider. I think I want to put the corner sticker there. I typically, I know a lot of people cover up a lot of their boxes on their monthly views. Typically I don't um, because I don't want to, you know, I, it's a dice roll whether or not something's going to come up that I'm going to need to write there. I don't write a lot on this monthly view and I always think to myself, well, if I take roll the dice and something does come up and I do really desperately need to put something here, I'll just stick a little box sticker over it and write in what I need to write in. So, okay, decision made. There we go. The only other thing I want to do then is sprinkle a little something around and that's where I like to get in here and find the little words like writing, putting relax on there somewhere. Um, this, by the way, see how scuffed this page is? This, it came to me this way. See how, uh, it's hard to tell on camera, but there's a whole, it's all scuffed up. There's all kinds of dark marks all over the page there, which I was pretty bummed about, but it seems like that happens more and more. I don't know. I ordered this one online last year, so... Here we go. Me, time, relax. These are such good fall colors. They match so well. Yeah, it looks like that's it. So let's just put some of these on that match the color scheme. This one says me, time. I'm just going to put them kind of in between days so that they don't take up too much of any one day. Let's put relax on a weekend, like maybe here. Relax, me time. Ooh, lazy day. That's a good one. And then that's it. It's just those three. Relax, me time, and lazy day. So, lazy day. Let's put one more relax maybe up here. How about, how about a dark green one? 
And that way I still have plenty of room to write anything on any of those days. Okay, it's done. Like I said, this was a quick one. Hopefully this video didn't get too long since I did a blackout during the first half. Um, but I'll put it in my planner really quick. There we go. There is my second October monthly view. I will have a separate video for my catch-all planner. So I hope you like this video. I hope it encourages you to decorate your monthly views. If you decorate it and you love it, you're more likely to use it. You paid for the space, so take, you know, make it work for you. I hope you like this video. If you do, please consider liking and subscribing. Thank you.